that's a reasonably modern tune on a reasonably modern instrument, the trumpet. But the ancestors of that go back a very long way. And, uh, well, let's see what they've got in common. First of all, all brass instruments, which is what this belongs to, are played in much the same way. You make a raspberry <laughs> into the end of a tube and it comes out as a note. But they're not all brass and they're not all as modern as that. That's often called a horn. And this was probably one of the first brass instruments. Literally, a cow's horn. You notice it's hollow, it's a tube, and if I make a raspberry onto this end, it comes out as a strangled note there. So a bit of a mouthpiece is needed. I'm using a piece of PVC piping. The original ones were probably a bit of hollow bone. Blow into that with a raspberry, and you get this. Probably used by shepherds and people for signaling a long time ago. But it's a bit dull, it's only one note. How do you change the note? Well, basically, with the musical instruments, you change the note by changing the length. At least, the things that you blow, you do. With a trumpet, that's done by pressing valves down. And as you press them down, you add on bits of pipe. The middle one adds on a little bit, drops the note a little bit. Add on this valve, it drops it a middle bit, and this one drops it a lot. And by twiddling the valves, you can see what I mean. I can get every note. But that requires sophisticated engineering and modern techniques. So a hundred years ago, or several hundred years ago, they borrowed ideas from the flute. And the flute does it by having holes down the length of the tube and stopping them with your fingers. Do that with a brass instrument, although it's not made of brass, you get something like the old English cornet. And they were made of hollow branches bound around with leather. I can't do that, I've got a bit of PVC piping again, but it makes quite a decent noise. Put a mouthpiece there for the noise, Stop the holes with your fingers and you get this sort of sound. If that has a sort of curious old world sort of quality, that was used in medieval music, the old English cornet. You make one yourself out of PVC piping and give it a go. But that wasn't the only way they could change notes with brass instruments, by changing the length as they played. Sometimes they kept the instrument the same and did different things with their lips. Now that's a post horn or a coach horn, because the coach that carried the post from city to city had to announce its arrival. And they had these things and they held them up and they did this. And you can get more than one note if the thing is long enough. The longer it is, the more notes you can get by changing your lips on the end. But it gets very hard to wave about. It's too long. So they coiled it. And this thing became this sort of thing, called into a circle. Still as long, so you get lots of notes. But it's very much easier to hold and carry about. Well, not very elegant. And the longer you made it, the more notes you can get. You can do one yourself, actually, out of hose pipe, a plumbing fixture there, and a funnel in the end. That's not very elegant. Bind it up, and it looks remarkably like the old hunting horn if you paint it gold and, and uh, muck it around a bit. You can get quite a few calls on that. That's really the old hunting horn itself. Lots of notes. And that was probably predated by what may have been the earliest brass, brass instrument of all. And that was simply a large conch shell, like that. See, if you grind a shell away, I wouldn't do it to this big one, but I've done it to its baby brother there, you'll see that cut half of it away and this really a long, continuous, conical tube. There's the mouth of it, but it goes back all the way down the shell. And that's really rather like the brass tube coiled into a tight sort of formation. So knock a hole in the tip that you can make a raspberry into and all that long coil is long enough to give you one or more notes. And that was the original brass instrument as far as we know. Here it is, big conch shell, opening there, hole knocked into it there, Make the raspberry, and this is the note you get.